shoe? Well, uh, as you can tell, I'm not much of a gymnast. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it's amazing to have you here with us, uh, Alexi. Just if you can perhaps relay or convey what it's like to for yourself to be here with some of these other sporting legends here in Boston, Berlin ahead of the awards. Немножко пояснить, как для вас была встреча со всеми остальными членами Академии сейчас накануне церемонии. Какое у вас чувство? I will speak in Russian. Okay? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. 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 Для меня это очень, конечно, важное событие в моей жизни. For me, of course, it's a very important event in my life. Потому что в 2009 году я стал членом академии. In 2009, I became member of the academy. И вот сегодня, год за годом, когда я встречаюсь с величайшими спортсменами со всего мира из разных видов спорта, для меня это семья. I know you came as you were still speaking, but we had Brian Abana, who's the latest member of the Laureus Academy, mm -hmm. um, obviously a former rugby player. Mm -hmm. I'm wondering if, and I actually know Russia's got a particularly strong rugby team and played at the World Cup. I'm wondering if it's a sport you, you've come across. Буквально две недели назад я вошел в попечительский совет в регби ЦСКА. Это вот такой клуб у нас есть. CSKA. CSKA, yeah. mm -hmm. So uh, literally two weeks ago, I became a member of the advisory council of uh, our club, uh, CSKA, which is a rugby club. Right, okay. Club yeah. And right. okay. Я был удивлен. And uh, since that my uh, son who is uh, 10 years old took up rugby and we've tried a lot of sports with him we had tried a lot of uh, different kinds of sports really? and uh, he was looking for the perfect sport and finally he said dad I found the kind of sport that I'm really interested in that really um, works for me and I was very surprised. So we've got yeah. a world exclusive that <laughs> yeah, yeah. your son plays. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm asking, asking why not gymnastics? Why not <laughs> yeah. uh, swimming? Yeah. Why? Because I, I love this. <laughs> um, gymnastics itself, is, is it something that you still follow very closely? Or are you involved in, in gymnastics or in the federation at all? Coaching, training, um, mentoring perhaps young people? Of course, I am vice president of the Federation of Gymnastics Russia. Of course, I am the vice president of uh, athletic gymnastics, mm -hmm. uh, artistic gymnastics of uh, the Federation of Russia. И, безусловно, я провожу свои мастер-классы для, для детей, занимающихся спортивной гимнастикой. Я провожу свое гимнастическое шоу, тем самым популяризирую спортивную гимнастику в нашей стране. So, uh, I'm the vice president of the federation and as well, of course, as well, I'm mentoring young people, mm -hmm. I'm mentoring uh, the youth and uh, children, um, organizing master classes and uh, also conducting my own shows, my own uh, showcases. И мы, uh, нам в этом помогает и правительство, и руководство регионов, в которых мы это делаем, и Mercedes-Benz, глобальный партнер Лориус. И для меня это очень отрадно, что Лориус и Mercedes-Benz принимают участие непосредственно в наших проектах. Это здорово. And the regional authorities, uh, as well as the government, is supporting us. But uh, of course, also Mercedes, as a global partner, is supporting us and uh, Laureus. And we are ha very happy and very glad that we have these uh, global partners. Uh, it's great for us. But uh, I think uh, we can do something more. Mm. But, uh, I mean, what, what is fantastic about these events is, and you know, we had Katerina here earlier talking about the, uh, the project visit they had yesterday with, with Kick It On, and um, just I'm, I'm wondering, uh, wondering about your experience in terms of when you, when you visit programs and, and dealing with young people that come from difficult backgrounds. 
um, as a former professional athlete to reach the absolute top, what it's like to, to, to mentor or look after somebody in, in a sporting way может быть из непривилегированных, так сказать, из контекста, который из более уязвимых страт общества. Вы как легендарный спортсмен, какое у вас чувство, когда вы посещаете такие программы и видите детей, у которых ограничены возможности в этом плане, так сказать? Ну, вы знаете, я сам сам вырос в такой социально неблагополучной семье. Меня мама воспитывала одна, и мы жили в одной ну, малосемейке, знаете, как это объяснить? Ну, когда mm -hmm. там в трехкомнатной квартире живут три семьи, один туалет, то есть как mm -hmm. бы одна ванна, поэтому mm -hmm. я знаю, что это такое. Mm -hmm. So, you know, actually, I myself grew up in a socially uh, vulnerable environment in an underprivileged, uh, I have an underprivileged background. Mm. Uh, my mother was uh, raising me uh, on her own, so she was a single mother. And I grew up in an apartment where um, there were three, three rooms, three bedrooms, and they were uh, shared. So in each of the bedrooms, there was one family and we shared the bathroom. И для меня, конечно, это очень важно, когда я могу поделиться своим опытом или присутствием, или поговорить с теми детьми, или родителями, или людьми, которые к этому приобщены. Это очень важный проект, и я с удовольствием в нем принимаю участие. And uh, for me, it's very important uh, to share my experience and to talk to these people, either to the children themselves or the parents or the people involved in the project and the program and um, talk about our uh, common values. And for me, it's very important and it's great to have this opportunity. So what about to your, to your own family and to your son? You mentioned that you're a family man as well. I mean, that must... That kind of messaging, you know, for the values at home must be really important. Of course. Ну, как, конечно, он же видит, как мы общаемся с людьми, как мы работаем. Конечно, это все передается. И, конечно, я хочу, чтобы он был хорошим, достойным человеком. Мы все делаем для того, чтобы наши дети были счастливы. Uh, of course, because he sees how we talk to people, how we communicate, mm. how we work, and uh, I want to convey this to him, and um, it gets across to him. And of course, I want him to become a good person, and we do everything to um, to make it possible that our children uh, will be happy. I won't keep you for too much longer. I do want to ask just about the awards tomorrow night. It's, it's obviously not the first time you've been to an awards. I mean, what do you look forward to the most? Что вы ждете с нетерпением больше всего завтра, касательно завтрашнего вечера? Чему вы рады больше всего? Я жду от этого, потому что, ну, но это, во-первых, это праздник для всех. Это, ну, действительно мировое событие в мире спорта. И я знаю, что уже на протяжении долгих лет у нас всегда что-то новое и интересное и я не сомневаюсь что в берлине все пройдет очень здорово я уверен в этом so um, of course I'm looking forward to uh, the party the festival because uh, this is uh, an event uh, of global scale for the sports world and uh, I know that each year there's something interesting going on, something interesting, something new uh, is happening and takes place. And I'm absolutely convinced that tomorrow in Berlin there's going to be uh, again a great event. And then I just want to finally ask you about your thoughts on the, on the state of global gymnastics at the moment in terms of the, the quality, uh, both, in, both in the men's and the women's. I mean, I know it's an Olympic year and that, that there's, there are some difficulties, should we say, at the moment, but just perhaps just on, on the quality of, of gymnasts around the world at the moment. Are you impressed? Are you, are you, Качество гимнастики на мировом уровне, так сказать, в мировом масштабе. Как вам нравится? Вы довольны? Нет? Как, что вы думаете о состоянии гимнастики как спорта? 
в общей сложности. Так но вы знаете, как и в каждой семье всегда есть какие-то свои проблемы. Но если говорить глобально, как вы меня спросили, то я думаю, что в принципе в гимнастике у нас, ну, я считаю, что удовлетворительно, хорошее такое, позитивное идет направление, которое позволяет с оптимизмом смотреть в будущее. You know, it's uh, like in every family there are problems, but uh, you were asking uh, about the global scale, and uh, I think that the level of gymnastics on a global scale is uh, satisfying, and uh, I perceive it as rather uh, positive, or there are positive uh, developments, and we are moving uh, in a positive uh, direction, and I'm uh, optimistic with regards to the future. Excellent. Well, we thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Enjoy the awards tomorrow night. Good luck with uh, with the rest of your year. Thank you. And um, we look forward to seeing your son playing in the Rugby World Cup <laughs> in the years <laughs> to come. I eh? hope to. That would be amazing. Thank you, thank you very much for your thank time. You. It's been fantastic to have you on pitch side at Laureus. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow on the red carpet. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Thank, thank you. you very much.